Hello my lovelies, so today what we're going to do is I'm going to teach you on how to make a pillow. Um, this is the one we're going to be making today, this is the one I've just made for this video, so yes. It's just going to be a step by step easy tutorial on how to make it, it was a requested video, so I hope you enjoy it and I hope it's simple enough for you to understand. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to want to get your fabric um, and you're going to want to lie it out. What I normally do is I fold it in half, so you've got the, um, the what would be the outside of the pattern facing you and the inside of the pattern inside. And then I just get my ruler and my chalk and then I just draw how big I want my pillow to be. You have to bear in mind you're going to be doing seams and stuff as well, so it will take up a, you know, a bit more room. Um, I think this is going to be quite a large one. And if you've got something um, that you've made, basically I just cut a heart out of a piece of fabric, um, and so that's just going to be like the middle part of the pillow. So this is going to be a bit of an odd shaped one. So you just draw your line with your tailor's chalk um, and your ruler. Okay, now I'm just going to draw one straight across. Okay, so that's when you've got your basics for your um, pillow. You're going to want to get your scissors and you're going to want to cut that out. And cut it out as straight as you can. I never throw any of my old fabric away that I not used all of because I'm making a quilt at the end of the year and yes there will be a video on how to make that um, and I'm doing lots of like making things at the moment like I'm um, doing up some of my old clothes and stuff um, even though it's winter I'm gonna see what I can do so keep your eyes out because there will be some more videos up on like clothing and stuff this is just a little DIY how I make a pillow because I did get a um, question asking if I could do a video about how I make a pillow. So there's your spare fabric, just fold it up, put it aside. Okay, and then so you've got your square for your pillow. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to turn it so you've got the nice side that will be the outside of the pillow inside. Okay, and then you're going, going to want to just sew all the way along two and a half edges. Um, so you've got to do that edge, that edge, um, and then obviously half of this side. So that way when you turn it inside out you've got enough room to stick your hand in there to put some stuffing in there. Okay, so yeah. So you're going to want to make sure that you've got your, oof, your fabric um, like straight. Sorry if you can hear the telly in the background, I'm in the kitchen obviously. Okay, and then you're going to want to start from one side. Okay, and you should have guidelines on the sewing machine, so just use your guideline on the sewing machine. And so. Okay, so you have done one whole um, side, so what you're going to do is you're just going to lift it up, just turn the fabric round, and then place it back down where it was before, and then just follow the lines again. Make sure you hold your fabric taut as well. Okay, and then you're getting to your last corner. Okay, and then once again you're going to want to lift it up and turn it round and then put it down as close as you can get to it and then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to sew half of um, this side that you're, you've got now so that way you can turn it inside out. So I'm just going to sew half of it like that. 
you get my stuff in, please? Did it's in the just... IKEA bag. I'm filming. Looks good. Thanks. That was Mummy Murphy. <laughs> That's my mummy. And then you just want to poke all the corners out as far as you can, like that. I'm going to need to set that corner a bit because it's come undone. Okay, so that is what it looks like at the moment. Um, I'm going to put my stuffing in it. Um, so you just literally, where you've got that hole where you left the gap, you just put your stuffing in. Okay, and then I will show you how I do the last bit, how I sew it up. And then also I'll show you how I decorate it. Excuse my hideous face, if you can see it, um, my skin's a bit bad and I haven't been feeling very well, so I haven't really bothered with, with makeup. So get your bag of stuffing. Okay, this was £5 for this, this bag and it is um, multi-purpose, non-allergic, washable polyester filling. And you're just going to want to take a load of it, like that, and just stuff it in the pillow. And you just got to pull it about and try and flatten it out. Nice. Right, okay. I'm going to put a little bit more in down there. And then that is my pillow stuff. So I'm just going to go and get a needle and thread. And I'm going to try and show you how I um, sew the, the corner up. Okay. Right. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is where you've got your fold, you're going to want to put little pins all along it, like that. So I'll just continue putting the pins on. So it is really awkward to film this bit. It will adjust, it will focus. Okay, so you just want to continue putting your, your pins along. So you're going to want to do something called a slip stitch. Um, so you just want to go from where it starts and you literally poke it up like that and a slip stitch is really tiny little stitches okay like that so you can barely see them. It's like invisible stitching. And then just keep going the whole way along. Okay so I've sewn up the corner, where is it? And it just looks like that once you've sewn it up if you can see. It's not a lot different um, from what it looks like there but it's obvious that you stitched it so the smaller you can leave the hole the better really okay and then I'm gonna get my little heart and I am literally just gonna oh you can't really see and I'm literally just gonna sew it on the front just there and you just roughly sew around the edge so I'm gonna try and film that for you and you just get it to where you want it So you just sew your little details on. Um, that's pretty even. And I'm just going to do some stitches. Just along the very edge. So there's the finished pillow. Sorry that I look a bit scummy and disgusting. I'm in my pyjamas, basically. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so there's my finished pillow with the heart on it. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you found it helpful. Um, it was requested, so there you go. Thank you very much for watching my lovelies. Don't forget to thumbs this video up if you enjoy watching my um, arty crafty videos. Um, also, don't forget to comment below and also the box below has got my link to my Tumblr, my Twitter, my blogger, you know, various other things I do on the internet as well. Alright, thank you very much for watching my lovelies and I'll see you soon. Bye!